Chicken and waffles is a direct result of jazz music in the United States. Let's make a European version. Here we have our flour, melted butter, cup and a half of milk, two eggs, two eggs. Here we have uh, baking powder, which is super duper important to making these waffles rise. How do you make a waffle Italian? Well, you can't make a waffle Italian, but you can add some Parmesan cheese and that will add a savory element. And that's the whole beautiful thing about chicken waffles, isn't it? That it's sweet and savory. If you have a little spray or something, that's cool. Generally, these are pretty non-stick, but if you just come in with a little butter, here we go. And you wanna leave a little bit of space because this is gonna rise up. And there it is. Waffle number one, and I can smell the Parmesan cheese, and that's lovely. And it should just pop right out. Very nice. Let's make another one. Here we've got breadcrumbs. We've got a little egg wash to make the breadcrumbs stick to the chicken. And we have the cutting board, which has plastic wrap on top of it with water underneath so that it doesn't move anywhere. If you were gonna make chicken and waffles, we're gonna go with boneless chicken and we're gonna get it thin. Why are we gonna get it thin? So that it cooks fast and it cooks evenly. We'll hit it with some salt. We're gonna go with a little Parmesan cheese on the inside so that it's protected by the egg layer and doesn't burn and just gives us sort of like a cheesy awesomeness. Push it in, push it good. Egg wash. So the Parmesan stayed on well because we patted it in there because we got some egg on it before we really went bananas. Now, oil. You don't need a whole ton of it. It just needs to be at the right temperature. All right, now when you go into a fryer, try and lay it away from you. That's what they do in Switzerland to get this fluffy egg thing happening. You gotta get the hot oil to sort of come over top and you can see it puffing up already. So that puffs, you get these nice lines. Do a little flipperoo here. Here comes our waffle. Oh, that is just a gorgeous turquoise. I think we should hit it with Parmesan cheese. I think we should hit it with honey. Honey and fried chicken go really well together. New jazz musicians that are living in Europe. There it is, the European chicken and waffle. When you get out of the club very late and you haven't had dinner, but it's almost breakfast time, this is what you should have. It's breakfast and dinner. This tastes like what Keith Jarrett would have after playing the Umbria Jazz Festival in Perugia.